Today I'm going to share with you a very cool product that we created here in Amazing Business Results. The product name is Real Last Update. Now, there is a big problem with businesses when the, the managers or the business owner like to see when was the last time that a lead contact or an opportunity was touched, the business owner will check the modified time. And based on the modified time, he assumes when was the last time that it was updated. And that's wrong. Let me show you an example. If I will go now and I will produce a new task as an example, and I will save it, you will see that the modified time was not changed. Now, the behavior that, that people have in businesses is not going into records and changing values in the record. They're changing tasks, events, phone calls. This is the real interaction that people has in businesses. And the modify time, the existing modify time is not producing this result. So we created another field named real last update. And the real last update always gets the last real update. When a task was created, modified, an event or a call or maybe a record on the page and that's being done across the application now i will show you on this session how you can do it by yourself if you want to and if you are not able to do it because it's involving some some deluge scripting if you don't are not able to do it you can always buy it from us of course in the in the description below you will have a link for it now also a side note we are going to launch in the next few weeks an e-commerce store that you can buy all our plugins and even even a complete system a full system with everything you know a full crm for any kind of business um we're, we're really trying to take this opportunity of the coronavirus when we know that people don't have so much money to produce an inexpensive crazy systems uh, and it will be also very, very fast. In a few hours, you're up and running with an insane CRM. Let's start. So, if we go to the record, you will see that you have here uh, the tasks. Uh, where is it? Here. So, you will have tasks, events, and calls. What you need to do is really to create a Deleuze script that's being triggered by those events. So if it's a task, event, or a call, and on the time that it's being triggered, you need to update its parent. In this case, it's this lead. And this is how basically you can, you can have the last update. Now, I wanted to show you also a report the report is untouched leads and based on the report you will be able to see all the leads and all the deals and all the contacts that no one touched them for a long time the only problem is is that i created this system today and every time let's say that i want to change just for as an example i want to change the last update to the 20th so i can show you in the report how it looks like the main problem is that it always goes back to today because it's really showing the last update. So I don't, I don't really have a way to demo how the report looks like, but the report should show you, let me just edit the report. It should show you all the uh, leads or deals or contacts that were not touched for over three days and those are usually the the those leads that you can capitalize on and this is extremely powerful okay so i hope that that you understand what we're doing here with this uh, with this uh, small plugin i think is extremely cool because it's giving the business clarity on which deals or leads or contacts should be touched and 
which are being taken care of and it's also showing you the lead owner so you can see all the slackers in your business and maybe give them some education. This plugin includes also one more feature. When you go to the real last update module, you will see that you have here everything that was done in the system. You will have here the module that was changed, if it's a lead or a deal or a contact, and you basically know also what was affected, why the last update was changed. So if I go, for example, to a specific contact, in the last update, I can see everything. So let's go here, change all those and create a time. Good. So now I have visibility on when this module was changed or this record was changed. Also, I can see if it was an event, a task, a call or something else. And everything is showing in one place. So, you know, you have clear visibility and that, that's a key. You need to know what's going on in your business, right? So I think it's very cool, okay? Thank you very much for watching this session. If you like my plugin, thumbs up so I will know to produce more of them. If you have any comments, additions, I will like to see them in the comments below. Thank you very much. We'll see you in the next session.